alienage culture. There has always been alienages. They have been around for as long as elves and shems have lived in the same lands. Ours isn't even the worst. They say that Valrayo has 10,000 elves living in a space no bigger than Denerim's market. Their walls are supposedly so high that daylight doesn't even reach the Benadol until midday. But don't be so anxious to start tearing down the walls and picking fights with the guards. They keep out more than they keep in. We don't have to live here, you know. Sometimes a family gets a good break and they buy a house in the docks or the outskirts of town. If they're lucky, they come back to the alienage after the looters have burned their house down. The unlucky ones just go to the pauper's field. Here, we're among family. We look out for each other. Here, we do what we can to remember the old ways. The flat ears who have gone out there, they're stuck. They'll never be human, and they've gone and throw away being elven too. So where does that leave them? Nowhere. Cerithia, Haren of the High Ever Alienage.